Hi, I'm Dr. Alan Weiger from MassageChairRelief.com and today is our bi-weekly massage chair industry update for Thursday, March 16th, 2017. We've got a number of things to go over today, so <coughs> let's get right into it. Uh, okay, out of stock, the, the Novo XT, which has been a, become a very popular selling chair, it's the 3DL track chair from Human Touch. Uh, that chair is uh, a low on supply and apparently uh, they're supposed to be getting replenished either at the tail end of this month. I believe the tail end of this month we should be getting more supply, but there is stock around, but it's very low. So if you're interested in that Novo XT, uh, go ahead and uh, get the bloody thing now before, it's, before you're out of stock again. Uh, I might also add that we recorded an intro and uh, first time use uh, videos for the, uh, for the Novo XT. Those should be out next week on the website. At least the intro will. Uh, we really like that chair. It's a, it's, it's a, it, it's, it's kind of has a unibody construction. It looks like a, a like a, a singular unit. Uh, it has a, the 3DL track, which is quite comfortable. Uh, you can adjust the intensity. I read, I read one of the reviews on my site about the chair, saying that you cannot adjust the intensity of the rollers in the uh, in the auto programs, but you can. You just go to the settings. And go down to yeah, go to the go onto the menu to, and click the, the the settings button, and then there will be an intensity adjustment button there for for anywhere from one to five setting, five being the most intense. So yes, you can adjust the intensity of that, uh, the depth of the rollers on the Novo XT in auto and manual settings. Also, the Zero G 5.0 has been back or oh, that's supposed to be in mid March, so that should be in this week. Uh, the Human Touch Navi Toss has been discontinued. I like that chair. It, it had the, uh, the, the rollers that went up and down the calves. The only chair of its kind like that and had 36 programs. And, and the people that, I, that bought it from me really loved the chair. I'm a little disappointed to see it go. But that has been discontinued. There's still 30 units left. I'm not sure what color. I think it's the light brown color. But uh, there is some uh, stock left. But as soon as that stock's gone, the chair is done. Uh, let's see what else have we got cooking as far as stock goes. I think that's I think we're, that's pretty much it for stock. Um, the, uh, the, uh, the 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 Ogawa sale where they're offering five hundred bucks off on the uh, Smart 3D, uh, two hundred and fifty off on the Active, and two hundred off on the Refresh. I believe that sale is being extended again until April fourth. So uh, if, that's, if those are chairs that interest you, go ahead and, and, and give it an order. If you live in Southern California, we have that Ogawa Smart 3D on display in our showroom in Southern California. You can go try it out. It has the, uh, it's a nice chair. It's a firm massage. It'll fit, uh, you know, tall and short folks alike. Uh, but it's what the, the, the kind of the standout feature of that chair is the um, Samsung tablet that connects to the chair through Bluetooth connectivity and so that's kind of a neat thing you kind of it's like using your your own like just your lab your uh, uh, iPad or tablet to run the chair it's, it's kind of cool but anyways that sale is still going on uh, now something that's kind of oh we, we added the Inada Nest to our website the Inada Nest if you remember from my my video on the uh, on the from the consumer electronics show in Vegas back in January early January uh, Inada had introduced this new model called the Nest, and I really like this chair. It looks like it looks like the Flex and uh, Flex 3S, and it looks like the Dreamwave, kind of a hybrid between the two. And it has full arm massage, like the Dreamwave does. Uh, but what makes this chair kind of unique is that it has okay chairs that have quad rollers, four rollers. Those four rollers work in concert on pretty much every chair. On the on the Inata Nest, the left and right are independent of each other, so the rollers on the right can adjust to the spinal tension on the right, the spinal muscle tension, and the ones on the left can adjust to the tension on the left side. So it kind of has this independent suspension, you know, like a car, uh, two and two, and they call that 3D LR, uh, LR uh, rollers, and it's a pretty cool feature. I'm not sure I was in the chair long enough when I sat in it at the show to really be able to differentiate and, 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 and sense the difference, but it was, it's a pretty cool feature. Uh, on paper, and I think it's going to help people, especially folks maybe that have scoliosis or some curvature of the spine. Where, because when you have a curvature of the spine, when you're looking at someone, they've got a curvature. Some muscles are going to be hypertonic or tight. Others are going to be stretched, and uh, some are going to be flaccid. Some are going to be spastic. But uh, I think that LR, the left and right independent suspension, if you will, uh, adjusting of that 3D roller is going to be beneficial, especially to folks like that. 
Oh, the other thing that's kind of cool about that chair is it has the rollers, uh, uh, what's the word? It's, it's like corrugated or something. It's got ridges. It's a round, a round roller, but instead of a smooth roller like all the other chairs have, it has like pumpkin, like a pumpkin. It kind of reminds me of a pumpkin. And it has ridges. And that goes up and down your spine and adds a little bit to the intensity of the, of the massage. But I really noticed it in the shoulders, like at the top of the, the, top of the shoulders where the, where the levator scapula is. Uh, I really found that to be quite, quite, quite a good massage. Um, the, the Nest is a more intense massage, probably the most intense of any of the uh, Inata chairs I've used in the recent memory. Uh, back in the old days, they had the aerobotics. Oh, no, sorry, the no, aerobotics, I'm getting mixed up. They had the Robo, Robo something or other, the D5 and the D6. Those chairs were kind of intense, but they, they discontinued those years ago. And the Dreamwave, the Yumi, the Flex 3S, um, and, uh, and now this chair have been the kind of the, the new generation of Unata massage chairs. And this one is the most intense of them. Uh, the, the, the Flex 3S is very gentle, and it's not great for taller bodies because the massage won't hit your neck. Uh, the Dreamwave is also a more mild massage chair, but a very nice massage, very sophisticated rollers, but uh, a roller system. But the, the Nest just seems to dig in a little bit deeper. Uh, the default massage is definitely more intense. So you're not an S. That's a bit, bottom line. What I'm getting to with all this yicking and yakking is that the chair is going to be a, is, is on our website. And you can go see the images. You can read up the the feature set and kind of start to become a little familiar with it. It comes out April 1st. We will have it in our showrooms. Uh, but anyways, I would think that uh, this would be a, a good chair to check out. Uh, the price on it's going to be. Is it 64.99? I think it's 64.99. But I'll confirm that. Okay, what else have we got cooking? Uh, oh, the uh, extended warranties. Uh, I have learned just over the last month that uh, both Inada and LaRocco are, are, are offering extended warranties on their chairs past 30 days. For most massage chairs, we've always understood that it would be a 30-day, uh, you know, you'd have, you'd have 30 days from the date of purchase to purchase the extended warranty. And uh, Inada and Loraco both offer extended warranty beyond that time. However, it gets a little bit more expensive, a little bit more pro-rated. Uh, it, it, not pro-rated, that's not the word I want to use. But the, the, the longer you wait, uh, the more it's going to cost you. So Loraco, for example, they've got, uh, if you buy the chair within the first year, it's 395 bucks, which is the price on our website. If you buy it between one and two years, it's 450 bucks. And if you buy it between two and three years from the date of purchase, it's 500 bucks. After three years, it's not available. The catcher with this is that <laughs> if you wait longer than a month, you can't buy it from us. You got to buy it directly from Loraco. So if you're buying, let's say, um, uh, let's say you buy the chair new and you, you want to, you, you decide like 60 days down the road, you know what, I'm going to get the extended warranty. You got to call Loraco for that. Within 30 days, you can get it from us. Uh, Inada, uh, their, their uh, extended warranty is 450 bucks. But if you get it, after 90 days, 91 days to a year, it's 500. If you get it one to two years, it's 525. If you get it two to three years, it's 550 bucks. But the pricing aside, I think it's pretty cool that you can get these extended warranties on these chairs. Now, again, uh, some people may argue that the Chinese quality is just as good as the Japanese quality anymore, and I've heard that argument a few times. But you know, put the money, put your money where the mouth is, as uh, as, as they would say. If the chair is really that, as, as some of these Chinese chairs are as good as the Japanese chairs or the American chair, go ahead and offer the extended warranty for up to three years after the after the date of purchase, or at the very least, jump up the uh, the the uh, the warranty to at least two or three years. So when that happens, then I think we'll really understand that maybe the Chinese chairs have got to that point where they're as good in quality as the uh, Japanese or the, uh, or the American chair. But that's just my, uh, that's, an, uh, that's an editorial. That's my opinion. That's not uh, anything to, to take to the bank. That's just what I, my, my, my gut feeling is on it, or my, my feeling is on it. Uh, OK. I guess the, oh, always, you know what? I get a lot of people, we, we, we get return chairs. And of course, over the last three months, we've gotten quite a few because we sell a ton at Christmas and Black Friday through Christmas, and there's always a certain percentage of returns. I can't even remember what the percentage is. It's very, very low. But the more chairs you sell, based on that percentage, you're going to get more chairs coming back. And so when we get a return chair, we put it on our website, on our pre-owned directory, and you can see that on the website. It's on our navigation bar under the title of pre-owned, 
and you can see what chairs we have that are coming back or that have come back and they're anywhere from a month to three months old. Uh, right now we've got a black Larocco that's uh, three months old and uh, it's in perfect condition. It, it's, it, was, uh, it was a local customer that owned it and so it didn't travel very far to come back to us. Uh, the chair retails for $84.90 for those of you that know massage chairs and know the Aerobotic 7 from Morocco. Uh, this chair, is, this, the used one is going for $69.90. But what, I'm, what I wanted to tell you is that we have this pre-owned directory and if you want to get a good deal on a chair, and I sell these chairs at a very discounted rate because I don't want to care, I don't want to keep a bunch of return chairs in my showroom. I want to get rid of these babies. So uh, we sell them at a very, very good, very good price. This one's $1,500 off. Usually they're $1,000 to $1,500 off. Uh, anyways, check it out, but don't like, don't think, ah, oh, you know, maybe I'll take a look in a month from now and see what they got. You might want to check regularly because if the chair is there, like this Larocco we just put up yesterday, this chair will probably be gone in another day. Uh, and if other chairs go up, we had, a, we had an Infinity IT8500 X3. It was up, I put it up in the morning, we sold in the afternoon. So be vigilant. If you really are serious about a massager and you want to get a good deal on a, on a like new chair uh, that has the full warranty, minus one to three months, Watch the pre-owned directory because you'll you'll get you'll figure out what the fat crap's going on uh, pretty quick as far as getting a good deal. And if you miss it, if you snooze, you lose, as they say. Okay, and then finally, I want to make sure I've got everything else covered here. Finally, uh, I just want to talk a little bit about return policies. I believe I've talked about this before, and uh, but it keeps coming up. Uh, return policies can vary anywhere from seven days. I saw one company that offers seven-day return policy. And it can go up as many as 90 days, which is what we have. And some companies will say free return shipping, uh, which uh, means that they're going to charge you somewhere else, maybe for the original shipping or whatever. Uh, some will charge you processing fees. Uh, anyways, what I, and I think I just talked about this recently for everyone's sake, but what I'm just going to tell you to do is when you are looking to buy a chair, make sure you understand the return policy of the retailer, the retailer from whom you are buying the chair. Uh, make sure you understand if it's really if it's a real uh, ambiguous uh, return policy like yeah free returns uh, you know red flag because I'll tell I promise you if it says free returns uh, they are, they're going to ding you one way or the other either with restocking fees or the original shipping fees uh, and so you're going to be paying probably 250 bucks two to 250 bucks anyways. Uh, and they'll get you. You'll get, you're going to get dinged one way or the other. I just updated my free report to talk about this because people get chapped because they think that it's going to be free this, free that. And then when the, when, 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 you know, when the rubber hits the road, they're, uh, you know, they're getting dinged royally. And uh, sometimes 25, 30%. Uh, sometimes even more, maybe 40%. So just buyer beware. Be very, very careful when you're buying a chair from a retailer, whether it's us or whoever. Make sure they've got a very descript return policy to make sure that it's it, the, it, the questions are answered. My return policy has evolved over the years because someone will bring up a point like, well, what about this? What about that? And I hadn't thought about that. So we make amendments to our return policy continually. So our, our return policy is very, it's a very living, breathing document. And you can see it on our website, but uh, it tries to cover everything. So there's no questions like, like my, you might look at mine and go, gee, that's a little complicated. Well, you know what? I'll tell you what's more complicated, having a real simple return policy and then getting dinged up the yin yang for, you know, 200 to 500 bucks uh, without even knowing that you're going to be paying that. So I'm just telling you to be careful and beware. But uh, that, that's enough of that. Anyways, that's about it for this week. Uh, we are going to be putting up the, uh, the uh, uh, you need Lojas uh, within the next month. And the, oh, as far as the, the Larocco legend goes, that chair is still on course for the end of the third quarter. They, they said third quarter originally. Now, I just talked this week to, to them and they said it's going to be the end of the third quarter. And so I, I'm going to just be conservative and say fourth quarter in time for Christmas. But that is the chair that has the, uh, the 3D L track with a 58 inch roller track and 3D adjustments on various segments of the spine, not just full 3D. It's 3D in the neck or 3D in the mid-back. You can adjust it separately or in the low back or hip. So anyways, uh, be, uh, just be aware of that chair. If you're still interested in that chair and you're holding out for it, uh, I don't know how it's going to feel when it comes out. I sat on the prototype at CES and it was cool, but we'll see how the final, final product is in, you know, at the end of the year. But anyways, if you have any questions about this or anything else I've talked about, please feel free to give me a call. I'm always available. And of course, if you found this video helpful, please feel free to thumbs up, like us and, uh, on our YouTube channel, and of course, share us 
on your Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Google+, whatnot, any social media platform you're on. We appreciate you helping us spread the word about massage chairs. Well, I'm Dr. Alan Weider from MassageChairRelief.com, and I will see you again in two weeks. Bye-bye.